Hi, welcome! In this video I am going to explain UDIM or UV tiles in Blender. In the previous video I explained how to use UDIMs in Substance Painter. You can also watch the tutorial. The video is available here and the link is provided in the description below. I will start with a simple cube and then I will create UVs for a creature. First go to the UV editing menu and enter edit mode by pressing the tab key. In the 3D view you can select the polygon to see it in the UV window on the left side. To see the UV of the cube let's choose the polygon icon or press 3 on the keyboard. By selecting a polygon you can see its UV. You can also turn on the UV sync selection option to see the UV in real time. Now I don't need to select a polygon to see the UV. Let's create a custom UV by making cuts on the edges. The cube already has a default UV but we won't be using it. I need good topology to create a good UV, which is also useful for UDIM. Let's start by separating the top. Select one edge, then hold down shift and select the other edges. Right click and then select make seam to cut the selected edges. Note the top is completely separated from the rest of the UV. Select the high edges to create another UV for the rest of the cube. These cuts are useful for reducing distortion when converting a 3D object to a 2D representation. Select the polygon icon and press A to select all the polygons. Press the U key then choose unwrap. Now I have my custom UV. Select the polygon icon or press 3 and then select all the UVs. Then press shift and space to select the move tool and move the selected area. Now if I select the scale tool and scale up the polygons it will increase the resolution. But there is no space for the single polygon. Now I need additional tiles for the UVs to create high quality textures. At the top section increase the value in the tile X field. Now I have two tiles and I can move one of the UVs to the second tile. Press G to move the UV and after that select all the UVs. Press S to scale up the UVs. Here you only need to adjust it. I've used UDIM with two tiles and now I can create high quality textures. If I export this model I can easily use the UDIM in any software. Ok, let's create UVs for a more complex model. Till here, if you enjoyed this video don't forget to like and subscribe to my channel. This model consists of two parts, the head and the body. Creating UVs for the head is complex and can take a while, I'll only focus on the body. Navigate to the UV window. Select the body and press tab to enter edit mode. As you can see there is no UV here. From the top menu activate X symmetry to create symmetrical UVs. Select the edge icon or press 2 on the keyboard. First, I need to start with the hands. Select an edge loop by pressing ALT and left click. Right click and then choose make seam to cut it. Now let's make a cut in half to separate the top and bottom of the hand. Press ALT and left click to select the edge loop. Here I need to select edges manually, press ALT and left click. Press SHIFT and left click to deselect edges you don't need. Alright, I need an edge loop here. Thus I need to deselect some edges by pressing CTRL and left click and drag. Alright, right click and choose make seam. I also need to make a cut here. 
The cut on the hand is there for the reason I explained. I want to relieve the pressure. No, I need to make cuts on the sides. Select the edge loop by pressing Alt and left click. I don't need the head. I need to deselect some edges by pressing Ctrl and left click and dragging. I need to manually select other edges because the topology is not good. I've used auto remeshing to retopologize the model, but the result is not good and it's also not symmetric. But I recommend you use a symmetric mesh to make the process faster. Right click and select make seam. Select the polygon icon and press A to select all the polygons. Press U and then select unwrap. Ok, good. Don't forget to activate the sync UV icon. This circular shape is the right hand, which I didn't create UV for it. And as you can see, all the parts are looking good. Now let's increase the number of tiles to get higher resolution. 3 is good. I need to scale up all the UVs together to get the same size. Press S. Alright, let's select the UVs and move them to other tiles. You can place each UV wherever you want. I've placed the right hand outside of the tiles. I don't need it. Okay, finally I have a U-Dim with three tiles. When I create textures for it, I get three textures, resulting in higher quality. Also, you can watch the tutorial on how to create u in Maya and compare it with Blender. Thanks for watching, if you enjoyed this video please give it a like and don't forget to subscribe to my channel. And if you have any questions feel free to ask in the comments.